If you've decided to overprint, it's usually because you have something really close together or complicated that is hard to register. So this would be hard to register. On a computer, it's super easy, but on the press, when you have large editions or large runs, a lot of times you get off just a little tiny bit and something like this will happen where you get a little tiny white line in certain places and most people wouldn't notice, but if you want to be good and professional, you're going to make it overprint. So what we want to do is you want to take your object that you're going to overprint and you just go up and give it a stroke in the same Pantone color that it already is. Give it about three and that way when you go to the print window, it's going to overprint uh, the the knockout that you already have in there and one of the ways we can text this is to go take our lighter color and move it up on top of our darker color and you can see just a little of that darker color or the lighter color uh, on top of the darker color so we know we were successful and that's how you overprint